So this location is part of my routine. On my way into church on Sunday evenings, I have a group that I meet up with. I stop here if I have extra time, and this evening I did, so always be charging sort of concept and just kind of mill around in the car. This is their offices. They're called Atom Power, and they developed a captive fleet solution where the charging posts are basically just dumb posts, and they have the actual electronics that are the um, EVSEs in their building in a breaker unit that connects directly to the feed for the utility. So these are just dumb posts. They've upgraded them over the years. They now have a purple metal on them, which is interesting. But as I said, I come here with some regularity. You know, if I have extra time, I swing by and I'll just kind of peter around. They offer these free to the community as kind of like a load test or beta test. But this time when I pull in, I connected and this post only the way it works is there's lights on either side and this post only had lights on one side i'm like oh that's new i guess this one is out for some reason and you know sometimes you'll come by here and they'll all be out because they're doing some kind of upgrade this is their offices they sell these to captive fleet customers all over the united states and uh so they're constantly working on them and upgrading them if they work cool if not then you just move on again free to the community but i am getting 80 amps. This is the first time I have ever seen 80 amps in my Lyric. And it says 17 kilowatts, but um, really that would be 19.2. The Lyric doesn't do a good job of show how much energy is being received. What it's showing is the amount of energy that's currently being added to the battery minus other ancillary systems that are pulling from the electricity so it says 17 being added and i wish there was some way to view you know how many amps and kilowatts were being received into the car but i'm very confident it's 19.2 i actually saw this a little bit before this number was 18. so for sure getting 80 amps or very close to it and 19.2 kilowatts so pretty cool here at atom power it looks like they're playing around with upgrades to 19.2 thanks for watching